Uh, hello, and welcome back to Your Perfect Cat. Uh, this time, in this video, I'm going to talk about how you can stop the night zoomies. And I'm doing something a little bit different. So while I tell you about the things I do to eliminate the night zoomies, uh, you can watch Val as he explores outside. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, please like, uh, comment, uh, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. All right. We just got outside. And so he's doing his dust baths. But uh, I don't know that I'm going to show you very much about him and his training today. What I did want to do is, you know, let you watch the cat um, enjoy his time outside while I talk about um, trying to uh, keep your cat from zooming in the middle of the night and keeping you up all night. So I've uh, been seeing on social media a lot of people complaining or mentioning that their cat had the zoomies and they didn't get any sleep. And uh, my cats don't do that in the middle of the night. It's a very, very rare thing. Uh, they do zoom, but they tend to do it once I'm awake. And they do seem to enjoy, they love to zoom actually, but they also like it when I watch them and encourage them to zoom even more. So I do a lot of different things to keep my cats from being too, um, too energetic overnight so they do sleep. Um, you know, taking them out, teaching them to uh, walk on a leash like this is, is a big deal, particularly for the breeds of cats that I have. Uh, and it's something that you can do with your cat too if you want. Uh, you don't have to, but if you want to s kind of stop the zoomies, the biggest thing you can do is play with your cat. Now, um, you want to remember that cats are diurnal, which means that they are awake, you know, at sunrise and sunset. And when you're gone all day, they tend to sleep all day. So they're storing up a lot of energy if you're not around. Um, the best thing you can do with them is to play with them at night before you go to bed. And I mean play until they are worn out, not until you are worn out. Um, I highly recommend a wand toy because it's interactive and cats love it and it gets them very active and jumping and you know you can have them chase it around the floor and you can have them jumping in the air so it's very energetic and it wears them out fairly quick uh, there are other things that you can do with them if you can't play with them right then the great thing about a wand toy is generally you can do that while you watch tv um, although the cat will prefer it if you're not doing something else while you're playing with them. Um, you can also get robot toys that they can chase around. Makes a big difference. The other thing that I do have that makes a big difference for them is a cat wheel. So when my cats have an excess in bit of energy in the middle of the night, they'll get on the cat wheel and run it off. And they do that at any time of day. And I highly recommend it. And I have a video about whether or not a cat wheel is worth it. And it most certainly is. And I recommend, uh, particularly if you live in the United States or any place where they um, ship them, because they do ship to a few other countries and it changes. It's, it'll be on their website whether, whether or not you can get a cat wheel in your country. Uh, I recommend One Fast Cat. Because they are sturdy. I've had mine now for, oh, I've had the same one, I think close to four years. I've replaced the pads on it once. So it has these little pads for the, for the cat so they don't slip because it's made out of plastic. And this is totally replaceable. I've also replaced the wheels. Um, so it's really it ultimately is really economical and right now uh, annually because it's we're right around um, Thanksgiving and Black Friday here in the US they go on sale and they usually have their best sale of the year uh, at this point so 
those are my recommendations if you want to keep your cat from having the zoomies all night long and keeping you awake. Um, and that little jump there, he was sniffing, but something, he stepped on something that bothered him there. So, anyway, back to, did you see the lizard? Uh-oh, there's a lizard. I know you can't see it from, it's so small, but he sees it. This is the lizard that Finn's been going after. Do you get it? You want to get it? You don't want to get it? It's moving around. Look at it go. You gonna go? You don't want it? All right. Well, thank you for watching. And again, this has been a little bit of time with Val outside and about what you can do to stop the zoomies in the middle of the night. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, uh, comment, and subscribe.